LeBron James courtside in Cleveland. I found this fascinating. I heard some people talking about his wife's hat. If you lived in LA for too long and you go back to a place like Cleveland in May, I understand. It's freezing out there to you, right? <laughs> like you don't understand. They all think it's it's beautiful, summertime, all that. It's freezing out there to you. Anyway, my man had a bottle of water, a cup of coffee, and a bottle of wine. The game's only two and a half hours. You know, <laughs> how many drinks is one man supposed to have? Is it something or is it a nothing burger? You know, there's speculation out there. Maybe he's trying to finesse his way back to Cleveland or he's trying to bring Donovan Mitchell to LA, which has been reported that the Lakers are a top suitor for Donovan Mitchell. You got uh, Rich Paul right next to you. Darius Garland is a clutch client. Just a lot of different variables there. Or is this the guy back in Akron, back at home, and he's like, hey, I can go 45 minutes to Cleveland, check out a game. The thing, LeBron is like a guy who gets married and then somehow is always like in these moments where it's like, he's not doing anything wrong on his Instagram story, but it's like, wait a minute, did you just get married? Like, why are you at this? at this wet t-shirt contest like what what are we doing like why are you like didn't you just get married what are you doing in this strip club in vegas at, at 4 a.m on a tuesday like i thought you had a wife at home like what's going on here did he do anything wrong not necessarily but it's just the whirlwind of speculation is one that he knows follows him and i think honestly it's a little bit of let's get back into the news here because why not sit in the suite and then you know what you don't have to have all those different drinks right next to you because you can just get up and go get one <laughs> and there's LeBron, a right there because we know lebron loves the attention he he knows what he's doing he knew him sitting courtside first of all he wanted the ovation from the crowd you see how when he wa they walked in i think the game had already started so he had the the late arrival you know big old lebron's in the building oh my gosh he's back in oh cleveland god, oh my god that's LeBron. it's already been some little speculation about him maybe trying to go back to cleveland i got a good roster now so he knows that this is going to stir up topics i mean it was on undisputed this morning it was a topic today he he's very aware of these things he's very calculated so of course he's not going to sit in the suite come on it's not it's not a lebron james move 40 year old man <laughs> saying wait no one's looked at me in quite some time